Well, Simon, a very close race, a hard race up here in Wollong. There's been a lot of pressure for the last few days, but you've done just about enough to keep that jersey on your shoulders. Oh, that's just fantastic. I'm not sure how much I've still got it by, but, wow, that was a tough finish. I think everybody knew what they had to do if they needed to dethrone Simon Gerrans. That was have a hard race from the very start, and everybody threw everything. This was a tough day today. Yeah, it certainly was, and the calibre of uh, climber that's in this race, it just uh, made that last final ascent extra tough. You know, the three guys that attacked off the front, they're some of the best in the world, so uh, it was bloody tough. For a bloke like Richie Port, who says uh, he's played down his chances, he was quite a competitor today. Oh, he certainly is. You never discount Richie Port, especially on a finish like that that he obviously loves. You know, I think uh, that's, uh, that's three from the last three for Richie here. And now, uh, yesterday you were a little bit confident going into today's stage, but it must feel a lot better now that we've got this Wollonga Hill stage out of the way. Uh, this is the, the toughest stage of the race, and it's uh, where the GC is generally decided every year. So if I've come out just in front today, hopefully that's enough. And it's also uh, lining itself up for a record fourth victory in the Santos Tour Nine Under. Again, a little bit of Australian cycling history. Yeah, that's right. Um, one stage to go, and you know, anything can happen, but... Uh, I'll tell you what, I prefer to go into that last stage in front of the behind. Well done. Good ride today. Thank you, Paul.